Hey guys, so this is gonna be a super quick ranty video because I'm kind of mad, not gonna lie. People usually hate when they're like, oh, I get wet. Calm down, it's a little bit of hard water. Hard water, it's not gonna kill it. Hard water? Hard ice? No. What is snow? So anyway, I was really looking forward. Usually it snows around the holidays. Freaking Christmas came, all these holidays came. It didn't snow at all. It was like kind of warm. So it didn't snow first of all. Second of all, yesterday my friend texted me. They were like, oh, it's gonna snow tomorrow. How much is it gonna snow? 0.3 inches. 0.3 inches? That random number. So that got me thinking. I didn't do any research about this because like I was too mad to research, but where do they get these numbers from? Who is like sitting in their meteorology lab, looking at like skies and like clouds and like predicting crap and goes, hmm. 0.3 inches. That random number. I understand maybe like five inches, seven inches, but the freaking projected snowing amount for like where I'm at is 0.3 inches. So I'm suing, but I decided since this is all about science, I have to bring some science to this. So I'm gonna do some science scientific investigation. Let's go. I need my one scientific tool that I have in this house. Where is that thing? A ruler. I'm gonna go outside. I'm not gonna throw my shoes. Oh my god, I thought that broke. I don't give a crap. Do I give a frick? No. Mail? I don't care, I'm not picking that up. All right, so the snow already, I don't know if this looks like 0.3 inches to you, but it's 0.3 inches. Okay, I'm feeling, okay, I'm kind of embarrassed. I don't care. I'm gonna find a spot of snow where the snow didn't melt at all because it has to be like, the variables have to be controlled. Scientific experiment, like we have to control variables. So if like a squirrel peed on it, the, the pee could diffuse the snow. If the sun, the freaking sun touched it, that'll melt the snow. So I have to find an area that's not lit with sun, not peed on, completely flat, not touched by human beings and measure it with my scientific measuring tool. It's a freaking bendy rule by the way, don't you like it? I think I got from Dollar Tree. Look at the reflection of the sun. <gasps> ready? Where's the sun at? Okay, look, ready? All right, let's search around for flat snow. Oh yeah, I forgot I'm mad. I never make videos when I'm mad, so this is kind of fun to do. <gasps> oh, I mean. Oh, that car is kind of, I mean. Okay, so this place is super sunlit. Cause like there's no trees so all the snow here already melted so let me go back to where i was okay the, over there looks really good that floor right there there's it's blocked by the houses i don't think i'm out okay let's cross oh you can wait you can wait too it's gonna be super embarrassing to do hopefully nobody sees me okay this is all stepped on this is not good for my experiment what the frick i left the door in my house open so hopefully nobody comes in okay perfect found the perfect spot why are there people everywhere? Right, this is like not touched by humans. Are you ready? So we're gonna use the inches side, obviously. So where the zero starts, that's about... That's 0 0.3 inches where the zero starts. All right, so this ruler better go all the way up to zero only. I think, yeah, I don't care. <gasps> okay, I haven't moved my hand since I did that. And I measured it so precisely. And the ruler isn't cut up by like 0.10 of an inch, so at point that's not 0.3 inches. I'm gonna go home, keep my hand exactly where it is, and calculate exactly what that is for you, and sue the meteorologists, the freaking weather companies. Hose. I'm back home, and here is exactly where the snow reached up to. So here's where the snow reached. It's like one. No, it's not one tenth. It's one out of 16 inches less than the. I don't. This is too much math. It's just one of these little thingies, less than one and a half. So. I'm just gonna say about 1.5 inches because I don't feel like doing that one out of 16th inch freaking little minuscule math. So it reached over here, one and a half. Oh, you have to count what's less than the zero because the zero also counts. What's less than the zero isn't included in the freaking inch. I don't know who makes rules and who decides to start zero after like 0.7 inches. <laughs> so, based on my final scientific calculations, here's what the freaking weather company said 0.3 inches. Here, with, you saw it in your own eyes. There wasn't no freaking scientist behind the board telling you. That's like more than one off, first of all. So you guys are wrong and I'm actually gonna sue you. So yeah, basically this video is really useless, but I just needed to get this off my chest. It kind of annoys me when it doesn't snow. People hate the rain, people hate the snow. 
I personally love the rain. I like the snow. A year, maybe like three times a year, I like it to snow so we can have snow days off. It, didn't, it snowed once and it wasn't even during a school day, so it was freaking useless. Thanks for watching this video. Hopefully, I enlightened you. I taught you about the world, taught you not to trust the news or the government. That was a conspiracy theory, but it's not even a conspiracy theory. It's just a conspiracy because I proved it wrong. Meteorologists are fake and they should be exposed and we should all sue them. The end. Damn, I'm angry. All right, now I got that all off my shoulders. I'm happy now. Mm -hmm.